Happening today, the World Health Organization announced the pandemic is no longer in the phase of a global health emergency. More than one million people died here in the U.S. during the three-year uh, period of that pandemic. And News for Tucson's Gabrielle Parrish is live from Midtown with more on how people are reacting to this latest declaration. Gabrielle. Sean, people that I spoke with today tell me that they are feeling a sense of relief to know that the pandemic is coming to a near end. But I'm here at the Pima County Health Department where health experts stress that the pandemic is not officially over. Some people I spoke with today are also still masking up just to stay cautious. Now, this is Siobhan Morris. She tells me that she calls herself a bubble baby, meaning she has a lot of health complications and she can get sick very easily. That's why she still wants people to mask up. It's, I feel like it's still needed because people like, people like us who have weak immune systems or just bad health and can get sick easily. Uh, people not wearing masks, it's spreading. It can be very harmful to us, uh, us, including some even dying. Although the World Health Organization announced that the pandemic is out of its emergency phase, Dr. Teresa Collins with the Pitt County Health Department tells me that they know COVID is still here and it's hard to predict what's going to happen in the next six to nine months as they just don't know. So I then asked Dr. Collins, should we treat COVID like the flu? And this is what she has to say. Not seeing that we're going to have a peak yet. So our hope is that it will level off and that we won't see those horrible peaks that we've had in the past. But I would say right now, we still don't know. We're gonna to have to see what happens. Dr. Al Dr. Cullen also tells me that we have about 500 COVID cases per week here in Pima County, and that's low along with hospitalizations are low. So the good news is if you want to go out and enjoy the Cinco de Mayo and all of the festivities that are happening in May, it is okay, but just be careful as COVID is still here. Reporting live from Midtown, Gabrielle Parrish, News 4 Tucson.